Smile ninety four one, the base party station inside the nut house. <laughs> Shout house. out to Haley who got hooked up with those circus tickets. We'll have those for you all week long. But I have a uh, question for everyone. This is about to blow y'all mind. Get so, ready. Get ready. <laughs> I already know a bunch of you. So, anyways, when we were on vacation, on the way back, we stopped at a friend of ours to kind of break up the long trip and the long drive from Cincinnati all the way home. So, we stopped in Atlanta to uh, visit some friends of ours. So, when we got there, it was later on, you know, in the e in the evening. So, we were tired from the drive. So, we were able to, uh, you know, take a shower, rest up, and, and then head out in the morning. So, Spanky. when it was my turn to take a shower, I got in the shower. The water Water was started. I was already in there. I was already wet, and then I realized, oh man, they don't have any soap. There's no wash rag in here, or or, 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 um, or anything to use besides this loofah and some body wash. So I used the loofah. Is it wrong to use someone else's loofah? You nasty mother. That's all I gotta say. I what was I supposed to do? Listen, what? Uh uh. Mm mm. Mm -mm. Well, use your hand. That's what you gotta do. You don't use somebody else's own lover. They done scrub off their crevices and dirt, as Orlando was saying earlier. Well, I, I, nasty, I, boy. I scrubbed all my crevices <laughs> with that loofah. Uh, hit us up. Is it wrong to use someone else's loofah? 888-429-0941. Oh, my God. We gotta know. And I, you know what? Let's make it a two-part. I Is it different if the loofah belonged to a girl than a guy? Oh, oh. Is it okay then? It changes the game! <laughs> it's changing! <laughs>